following video shows you the best value of the monthly boosters in Pirate Galaxy. Pirate Galaxy is a free to play game and some boosters are pure luxury. I am not going to talk about free hour boosters, pilot avatar and rename pack, clan license, buddy networks, ship alloys, crew night vaults and memberships. They may get an own video. Let's start with the blueprint trackers. To get the best gold value I divided the price by the percent. And like you can see here, for the blueprint trackers the best value is on the first blueprint tracker and the worst is on the last one. And I recommend to buy them as soon as you start collecting the rare blueprints or in standard missions. And yeah, then they are mostly helpful, else it's like unnecessary. Next on my list are the Kroonid refiners and the best value is on the second one and the worst on the last one. And you should buy this if you really want to farm a lot because it saves a lot of time and during a global booster it feels really good. Going ahead with XP memorizers. There is the best value on the second one and the worst on the last one. But to be honest I don't recommend buying any of these because leveling up is really easy and limited fast and you don't need to buy these. So if you want to have more fun during leveling up don't buy these please. The following boosters don't affect player vs player. It only affects player vs environment. So starting with the damage deflectors. And there you have the best value on the first one again and the worst on the last one. But here you have to note that 1% is stronger than 1% firepower relay. Keep that in mind. Moving on to the firepower relay. Here you have the best value on the first one and the worst value on the last one. The strongest effect appears in series when you're playing solo because the damage over time gets increased and you are more effective. Last on my list are the engine boosters. Here you have the best value on the first booster and the worst value on the last booster. With the engine boosters you can run away from Mantis really easy even without using afterburner. But warning! If you buy any of these, you will feel the difference between playing with and without boosting. You can get addicted to them to play normal and start spending more and more money. The more money you spend for Pirate Galaxy, the more your addiction increases and you will feel that playing without boosters is frustrating. So be careful with the boosters and the money you spend and always keep that in mind. So. With that being said, I want to say bye bye and have fun.